Hello everyone, welcome back. My name is Tisa. So great to have everyone here. I'm going to be looking right now into the Earth signs right now. It's Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. This is November the 7th and November the 8th of 2023. Everything you need to know about me is going to be right down below in the description box. Thank you for your love and your support and your donations and all. Now, um, I will put my text line down below so you can text me if you'd like to get a reading. I am open and available today. And also, if you'd like to ask a question about your situation, uh, I do have a Black Friday deal that's coming up on November the 9th, the 16th, and the 24th. And I will put all information about that right down below in the description box if you're interested. Another thing is on my channel, I go and find a secretive energy. It's hidden and I bring it to light. The mystery solved here. Please enter here now at your own discretion and take a resonate in this message and leave the rest. Don't make it fit here. It's not your story. So, Earth signs, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. The temperance card right here. This is balance and harmony now. Maybe somebody does want to reconcile with you. I get the sense right here. Maybe they do. Uh, it could be a Sagittarius. Sometimes the Tempest card can represent Sagittarius energy, you know. Um, so maybe a Sagittarius is going to be significant in the next 24 to 48 hours. It even could be something that's happening in the Sagittarius season that also could be somehow significant to you, okay? I just feel like the universe, look at that, the Wheel of Fortune and the Sun. I just feel like something here is fate. The sun, that's going to be realized to you right here, right? That some cycle is complete, okay? I feel like with this one right here, right? And at the top it says Archangel Zadiel. Zadokiel, sorry about that. Zadokiel is that um, this is the angel of mercy. <laughs> Angel of Mercy comes. Maybe it had to do with a Sagittarius in some way. It doesn't have to, but it could. Okay, the chariot card right here could be a cancer or traveling. Okay. What's in my story here, please? It's almost as if you just disappeared from something here. Okay, because this one at the top is Archangel Metatron. It's kind of like have awakening or just disappear. Angel of mercy, you disappear? Wow, could be the case. <laughs> well, somebody disappears? Something like that? Could be a um, Sagittarius or a Cancer. Or maybe these seasons is going to be very much significant in some way. Okay, what's the message here, please? Temperance right here in the tray. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. I feel like this is a good time right now to give the universe thanks for something right here. Okay, yeah. The Four of Wands. It represents excitement, celebration, even a relationship right here. So, give the universe thanks. I also see Aries here. But but give the universe thanks for something here. Okay, in some way, I feel. <coughs> so, much right here, please, for Earth signs. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Earth signs right now. November the 7th and November the 8th, 2023. Look at that, the world. Yeah, some major cycle is complete. I'm getting over here for Sagittarius or Cancer or a house or merch. Something like that. Okay. And then this one right here is saying Archangel Michael. Okay, which is the Archangel that defeated the enemy. So I'm not sure if somebody's an enemy or just the fact right here that you're protected right here. But if there is an enemy here, I feel like they're defeat. <clears throat> I don't know why I can't talk right now. Hang on, let me get something to drink. Okay, sorry about that. But some energy is defeated. Hmm. It's making me think of this song. Um, oh, I, I know his name is Sean. Okay, I can't remember the last name. Sean. And the name of the song is Mercy. Yeah, that's the name of the song. But Seven of Swords right here. See, something more is going on here. Okay, I feel like some enemy is defeated. Or you can get excited, okay, I feel right here. Because I feel like with these two, it's like mercy. You just disappeared. Or somebody disappears. Or some enemy disappears. Or something like that. Okay. What's the message here? 
Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What's the message right here, please? Okay, yeah. It could be an Aries. Yeah, I was seeing Aries. This is Aries right here. It could be a father. Yeah, but this is the Aries for some people here. Because I got two. This is the see the um ram right here. Right here. The symbol and this is the symbol again. Right there. So I feel like an Aries is an enemy or um a Sagittarius or a Cancer is. Okay. Somebody may want to reconcile with you. Yeah, the seven swords do not want to stand here. I feel like somebody's cheating and lying here. Or there's some more that's going on. You just disappear from it. I'm getting that's how I'm seeing it here. Okay. I feel like you just disappeared. The angel of mercy come here. Okay. Hmm. Has something to do with a Sagittarius or Aries right here. Or cancer. And you just disappear. I just am getting that's how I'm seeing this right here. You disappear off the path or you disappear off something here okay or you're protected or angel michael's here or angel michael's there okay what's the message for the spirit holy angels i have eight of cups right here see i feel this number them get here this one right here at the top it says venus and this is the four wands a relationship a merge maybe See, Venus is all about something looking really pretty in some way, right? But that Saturn right there, there could be some more going on here. Maybe something here really isn't what it seems. And some relationship or marriage for some people are right here. Okay, I feel like you have desire to walk away or they do. Something like that, right? All right. Here's a message right here, please. Something's not what it seemed to be, I feel. Okay, yeah. Okay, if somebody's walking away from a marriage or something like that, they realize it's hopeless right here. The world and the page of cups is hopeless. Some people here, they're walking away from a merge. It's hopeless here. And this new cycle is hopeless because you disappeared or something like that. <sighs> hmm. Could be the case. And now I'm hearing that song, um, Imagine Me, okay, by Kirk Franklin. He said, Imagine Me living in a place, right, where there's no insecurities. <laughs> I'm finally happy. Imagine that, right? Wow. Imagine you're finally happy. Wow. And I feel like you're not even insecure about something for some people here. Okay. Or this could be the case. Like, imagine that. Some cycles over. Some people here. You could get a new cycle. You can get a new lover. Could be the case for some people here. Somebody's actually sending love gestures could be it here. Imagine that. Hmm. You're finally happy. A love that's really in it or something like that. Hmm. All right. What else here? Two of Wands right here. See, I feel like this is an enemy over here. A Sagittarius or the Aries. I feel like they might be an enemy. Because I feel like right here, they're trying to influence something right here in some way. Am I picking that up for you last couple of times I did this reading? Last couple of days. Somebody wants to influence something right here. Or somebody has plans for you or reconcile with you or something like that over here. Okay, yeah, it is, that's the truth. This is the enemy. I'm getting that's the enemy right there. Okay, yeah, the Mars at the top. Okay. This is a very general message. That's the way I'm saying here. Okay, that the Mars, it represents war. Okay, and I feel like this is an Aries right here that's also ruled by Mars. So I feel like some war or enemy over here that's a Sagittarius or Aries. Free it. That's what I'm saying right now. What's the message right here, please? Oh, yeah. Eight of swords right here. They're powerless. Wow. Because you disappear or something like that with the Metatron at the top. It's like you disappear or you have awakening. Something here is not going to move or something like that. If they cheat in line over here with the cancer or with you or whoever it's about, it's not going to move anywhere. It's not going to go anywhere. All of a sudden, they're restricted or they're powerless, something like that. Hmm. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. What's the message? Yeah. Third party. Because some people here, they walked away from a merge to a third party for some people here. They're going to learn right here. They can't just be walking away from the merge to a third party or something like that. For some people, they did it. I'm getting right here. <laughs> so, I just feel like for some of you right here, um, there's an enemy here. Just pray, okay. That's the enemy here for somebody here. 
Okay, five of wands right here, reverse. I feel like you're coming out some conflict right here. Or this new cycle, they want to come out the conflict. For some of you, I'm getting right here, the cycle's completing right here with the enemy. Okay. Others, it could be beginning. So I'm not going to, you know, play with games right here. Okay. But others, it could be beginning for some people here. Okay. But the five of wands right here, reverse, they want to come out some conflict or they don't want you to see them as an enemy or they don't want you to see them they had a third party or whatever. They don't want you to see something like that, I feel. You know? Put some message right here, please. Okay, we have right here, they got a queen of cups right here. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. All right. Sorry about that, you guys. I had to pause. I had a baby here today. And he's just a talk in the background. So if you hear him, he's talking, okay? But anyway, um, seven of swords right here. They're powerless. They're going to be powerless right here and moving forward in some type of way, okay? Because either you disappeared or they're powerless right here with a third party that could be a cancer right here, okay? Or Aries, Sagittarius, um, Pisces, or Scorpio. They're powerless, okay? That's the angel right here, Zadikul. That came is, is the angel of mercy. Because they're powerless. They're enemy for real, I feel. But they're powerless at a third party or they, they're powerless at something. Okay, it don't have to be a romantic sense. It could be any kind of way. But somebody's powerless over here, I'm getting. At cheating and lying in some way. Right, because the angel of mercy either remove you from the situation or something like that. Okay. Yeah, the moon card right here. Yeah. A Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. I have them here three times. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And the Aries here. Okay. They're powerless right here. Having some illusion or some secret life. Something like that. They're powerless. Ooh, child to child. Mm. So if they're enemy for real, right, they're going to be powerless at the secret life, which may get them caught. I'm getting for some people here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's the truth right here. Knight of Swords. That's the truth. I'm getting right here. Right? Yeah. Hmm. Star, yeah. For some of you right here, right? This even could be right here. They was attacking something right here with their words or whatever kind of way it was. They even could be abusive to the third party or to you. I'm not sure if they was abusive to you because they want the third party or they was, they're abusive over here to the third party. For some of you, they're abusive to the third party I'm getting right here because they can't be with you right now. So they, they're abusive to them. They could be a narcissist. Don't have to be, but they could be for some people here. And if they are a narcissist right here, I feel like they're abusive to them right now. Hmm. I'm getting right here. Okay, hang on. Let me get the baby. So they're either over here abusing the third person right here. Or they was really, really um abusing. Maybe it was you because of a third person. Could be the case. It could have been some argument right here. Some argument could have brought out the truth. Maybe somebody realized about a third person right here. Okay, but this feels like attack in some way. Whether it's verbally, most likely it is. Or any other kind of way. But somebody's attacking somebody here, I feel. Okay, and I feel like they're doing that because they came out of the conflict right here. They realized right here that either you was removed from some situation right here. Or like, they can't be having a third party here. Pretty good. I thought they was having hope to be with you for some people right here. It could be Aquarius or anybody else it could have been. But they was having hope for something right here. But the five wants are very come out of the conflict right here. The world, some cycle complete, you're protected here in this new cycle or something like that. Okay. Hmm. What's the message right here? And so we have a whole lot of archangels that definitely showed up right here. Okay, this one right here is the Wheel of Fortune Reverse here, okay? And the Wheel of Fortune Reverse, somebody here didn't want something to end, I feel, over here with um the Cancer, the Pisces, or the Scorpio, I feel. I feel like that's a third party for some people here, okay? And I feel like they didn't want something to end with that energy right there with the Wheel of Fortune Reverse. But it's not going to go into their favor, I'm getting right here. It's not going to go in their favor with the energy there. Okay, and I feel like that's the mercy or something like that, right? They either make you realize that somebody here is fake for some people here. Um, that's one way it could be. Hmm. There's another thing, five wants of verse. They come out of the conflict right here. They can't affect you. And your beauty or your art or something like that. They can't. Okay. They can't affect something like that. I'm getting right here. Because we have, you know, four archangels here. This is Joe Field. 
the Archangel of Beauty and Art. Okay, so five of wands reverse, they can't affect your beauty or your arts or something like that. They can't affect it. I'm getting right here. Hmm. This also could be somebody speaks many languages right here or somebody's in a foreign country or something like that. Okay. Yeah. Because Joe Field also could represent that right here. Okay. This could be somebody that was teaching you a different language or whatever. But the Wheel of Fortune reverse, yeah, they didn't want something to complete over here with somebody. I feel I'm getting a water sign or Aries. They're powerless at illusion. Hmm? They're really powerless at illusion because you'll be removed and something like that. Yeah. They're juggling for some people here. They do they're gonna be definitely restricted from juggling right here. Or cheating and lying or having illusions, something like that. Okay. But some of you they was trying to have illusion, all right. And they could have attacked you with their words that made you realize something's illusion or it made you realize it's a third party here. Something about communication in any kind of way. As many ways to communicate. The Knight of Swords could be texting. It could be email. It could be um, direct messaging. Let's see what else we could do. A voice answering service right here. Right? Straight talking, communicating with you. Right? It's something like that. But I'm getting like, that's what's going on. Something about communication right here with a third party. Something like that. Okay. And then once I have to end with somebody over here, right? So, you know, they could be restricted from the third party. If not, you'll be removed, I feel. Yeah. Somebody knows that they're single. They know that. It could be a Virgo. Somebody knows the Virgo's single. It's pretty. They know that. You know, or the Virgo knows that. It could go either kind of way. So the Virgo could know they're single too. So can that's the way it could be? But somebody knows somebody's single, I feel, you know. <clears throat> or this even could be right here. Like, you're going to celebrate. You're going to live a life full of luxury right here. Yeah. Pretty. Okay. Four of Wands could be a beautiful house. Celebration. Art. Again, maybe something here's about art or painting. This is another card of celebrating. So you're going to celebrate in some way. You're going to come out of the dark. You'll be happy, I feel. Okay, so you're going to be removed from some situation over here that's not proper for you in some way. I feel like you'll be happy. Okay, I feel like it, yeah. And something may just simply be hopeless with somebody over here that's trying to hold on to a third party or that's an enemy in disguise or something like that. Their enemy in disguise, I feel like the way they're going to get caught up here is either they're going to either um, attack somebody with their words because of a third party or illusion. Okay. Somebody may realize illusion, and this all stemmed around a third party over here, okay? Because they can't have that illusion. So we get on here. They just simply can't, okay? There's too many angels here. It's not going to work. Okay, clean the wands right here. And I just feel like you're going to be confident. You're going to be self-assured. You're going to heal. Some of you, you're famous, or you're going to become famous. I feel like you'll be really beautiful. You might even paint a picture of a really beautiful woman or a person or a child or anything. Or anybody could be, okay? That's what I feel happening here, okay? Okay, so Ace of Swords Reverse. Somebody's not going to be victorious in this new cycle right here, okay? With a family or sort of like that. If, you know, they're not being realistic or they have this secret life or third party, it's not, it's not going to work. It's not going to go anywhere. They're waking up to know that right now, okay? Somebody is waking up to know that right now, I'm getting. Okay, any other message here? Yeah, there will be regret. They could be focused upon a loss here in some way. Okay, because if they're enemy right here, they cannot move forward with the enemy energy. It's not going to work here. There will, be, there will be regrets how something is hopeless right here. Okay, and how you're healing and that you're self-assured and that you're going to be vibrating, I feel, at a high level or frequency, I feel. Okay. You could be earning money, something like that. Maybe they're jealous because you're earning money and they had a third party and they're restricted from people here. Okay, so anyway, that's what I have here. Thank you so much for taking a look here. I send you all peace, blessings, love, and light. And namaste to all of you.